Hello, you wonderful people. So for today's video, I want to talk about some kind of sad news I ended up finding out yesterday, and that is the fact is that Supergirl is coming to an end, that this next season, that this sixth, uh, this sixth season of Supergirl is going to be the final season. And I've said it before uh, in a comment that I it left me feeling mixed. Because I'm in that situation where I'm that type of person who never wants anything to come to an end. And because also, like, I think it's also because it took me by surprise. Because obviously, like, it was already clear, like, you know, the show got renewed for a sixth season with, like, a lot of stuff on the CW. Uh, but there was no talk, at least not that I saw at the time, talking about this being the final season. So it's a decision that was kind of made after the fact. And that kind of, I don't know, it, like... I'm sure the network has its reasons. I haven't looked into the reasons because I don't care because it's like I like what I like and I don't want it to end. So whatever your reasons are, those are your reasons. But obviously I've heard some speculation. That's speculation on some people's part about why it's coming to an end. That's not the point to me. It's just the fact is that it's ending. It's all that really matters. And it's just it's just kind of a bummer because at least like with the Arrow situation, they made it clear like when it's like, oh, it got renewed for an eight and final season so you went into it already it was already clear like we're going into this it didn't seem like they're going into this knowing this is going to be the final season it just retroactively but it's still that thing of they have they're supposed to start some of the stuff was saying like starting production maybe at the end of this month um so at least they're going into this knowing like i mean i'm sure because they're going into this knowing it's their final season but it's just it's still just kind of a bummer for this, you know, just to be the end. Because, like, like I said, I don't want anything to ever end. I mean, that's the sad thing. Eventually, everything in Arrowverse is going to end. Obviously, new stuff is going to come in. But also, just some of the stuff that we've had for a while is going to come to an end. But, um... I don't know. You know, aside from just talking about the bummer news, it is the question of, well, how is everything going to play out in Season 6? Um... Because also something that is crossing my mind, too, it's like, well, let's not forget there's the whole shift in the whole Batwoman situation. And I'm curious what kind of effect that's going to have on Batwoman. You know, the whole Ryan Wilder taking over, you know, the mantle. Because obviously, like, you know, Kara and um, Kate are pretty close. What that dynamic is going to look like. I mean, I feel like they'll probably reference some of that, you know, in the final season. I mean, this being that connected universe and everything. But, um going into this you know obviously they had to end season five off you know a little short shorter than what they were planning obviously because a lot of stuff had to but obviously where we left off in the last season like Kara and Lena were on better terms obviously this whole Leviathan situation still needs to be taken care of while you know Lex is in this powerful position to you know reap the benefits of it all and obviously the whole um, brainy situation and obviously the whole him and Nia thing like her having a vision about him dying because she finally clicked in her head like what well, that was all about him sacrificing himself trying to stop all this from ended up happening and he's dying in the process so it's interesting because it seems like we are setting Lex up to potentially be like the final final antagonist but once again it's like because obviously they're going to be picking up the story, continuing probably whatever they wrote for season, the rest of the episodes for season five, like whatever direction the rest of season five is going to, because it was like, I want to say the final episode of season five was like 19 or 20, if I'm not mistaken. So like there was a couple more episodes, so we're probably going to continue that. But like beyond that, where's the next arc going to take us? And I'm feeling where things are set up. It's going to be Lex being kind of the final antagonist. Maybe, maybe not. Obviously, uh there's always a different direction because like we still haven't fully dealt with this entire Leviathan thing as I was saying before so there's obviously a lot of interesting story elements you're curious like how they're gonna where they're all gonna end up taking this season you know being I mean how will they plan on ending Supergirl and obviously the whole conversation is because we are dealing with the Arrowverse these characters are never done there's always a possibility of bringing them back in some shape or form their storylines can continue in other things and they can make cameo appearances I mean it's much like Constantine his story was able to continue on you know even though Constantine the show got canceled his story has been able to continue on through Legends of Tomorrow like like I said, it's just, the whole thing has just kind of been like this bittersweet thing. Because it's like, I always prefer you going into something knowing it's your final season rather than it retroactively be, oh, the show got canceled, so now this previous season has retroactively become the final season. It's happened too many times before. So them being able to kind of end it on their own terms is kind of something I'm happy about. Like I said, I'm just sad to see the show end because I don't want it to end. You know, I never want anything to end but also we're talking about a show that has run for six, this is going into a sixth season that's a whole conversation in itself too is like that's nothing to see that it's not like the show has had a short life it's had a long life because someone else who brought up the whole thing let's not forget 
It started on CBS, got canceled, and came back to the C came to the CW for like five more seasons, you know, including the upcoming sixth and final season. So that's not the snaze at. So like I said, I'm bummed that it's ending, but at the same time, I'm excited to see, you know, what they have for this, you know, final chapter of Supergirl and where the story and these characters, where they all end up when it's all, you know, said and done. Obviously, these are just some of my thoughts about the whole situation. I'd love to get to know yours in the comments down below. Really, that's all I'm going to talk about. Till the next time we meet, be happy, be safe, look like to the fullest, and enjoy it. Good day and good.